you talked about this before with your interaction with Brad Pitt, your interaction with, who was the other girl? Olsen. The Olsen uh, twins. Yeah. The, well, I mean, imagine being stuck on a plane next to me and you're yeah. like one of the Olsons, okay? And yeah. she's shivering and she's freezing and I'm, I'm purposefully like like blasting my air <laughs> on her. And she's, and she's in like a... She's in an Hermes like shawl and she's like, she's so emaciated and it was like, it was unbelievable. It was unbelievable sleeping next to Ashley Olsen. Yeah. That was another bull thing. But again, again, headlines are everything. And that was a headline. Yeah. And I was, I was expanding a brand. And I so if, if a couple celebrities need to have their goes bruised and if Ashley Olsen sleeping next to me on a plane needs to be shivering, I'm sorry. It's a small price you pay for being worth $100 million. Go so f*** yourself. Yeah. And you mentioned that with Brad Pitt also. You talked about something different. Or you talked about yourself when you were talking to her. Or talking to him. Talking to him. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. Look, if you're sitting next to Brad Pitt, what the hell are you going to talk about? Him? Oh, I really liked you in this movie. Yeah. No. So you're never going to believe Mike. Like, basically talk to him about what it's like to be an actual person, you know, that can go to CVS. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? He can't go to CVS. That's correct. Brad Pitt doesn't have an extra care number. He doesn't have the things print out. <laughs> He's Brad Pitt. He's got someone doing that for him. Yeah. So guess what? We talk about real world that no one ever talks to him about. 